Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new, my name is Alyssa. And if you couldn't tell by the title, today I am unboxing my new iPhone 12 Pro Max. I'm so excited, it just got delivered. It was like a whole deal. They delivered it to the wrong door. I showed the UPS guy my tracking information. I was like, it says delivered. And they're like, we don't have it. But then the UPS guy went to search for it and he found it, so thank God it is here. Here. Last year I did this video and it took off. You guys loved it. It was amazing I'm pretty sure people probably just searched it a lot. So I'm gonna make another one Literally, it's just me unboxing the iPhone. <laughs> it's nothing crazy, but of course I want to show you guys We will just dive right in So this is the box. This is my old iPhone. This is the 11 Pro Max and yes people ask like why do you need the new one when you have the 11 and Short story is I have T-Mobile and I pay for the jump program, which is the added insurance on the phones. And with that, every year I get to upgrade to a new phone. So I line it up with the Apple drops. So every year in September, I'm eligible for an upgrade. So every year I just upgrade to the new iPhone and that's how I like it set up. So yeah, whatever people are gonna judge, it's fine, it's my life and that's like, what I like is new iPhones and it comes with it so why not right so I'm opening it I have not even opened it yet oh yeah and the T-Mobile thing it's a trade-in program so I do have to send the 11 back and it has to be in good condition so I take great care of my phone so they do last me a while but here we go we are unboxing it is so pretty oh my goodness here it is that's what the box looks like Okay, so excited. Wow. Uh, my adrenaline is literally just so high right now from chasing around with the UPS guy trying to find it, but so pretty. Let me turn my other phone off so that doesn't interrupt. Okay, wow. So this is how pretty the box it comes in. It's very like slim. Let me see if I can find my other box. This is the other box that the 12 came in. So you can already see the difference that like, this one's like really chunky and this one's like really thin. So that's kind of cool. Okay, here we go. Wow, it is beautiful. So I went with the silver and I went with silver because it looks white to me honestly and they have the gold, the like black and the blue option. I didn't love any of them. Um, the rose gold is always my favorite but they didn't have that this time. So we went with silver, AKA white. Wow, okay. So in the box, it just has the cord. Oops. That was just the instructions that fell. So instructions, the cord, that's it. So it doesn't even come with the wall plug anymore, I guess they cut those. They're like, people already have enough of those. We don't need any more. So, wow, okay, it's actually like, Pretty hefty, hefty and like heavy okay so this is what it looks like so pretty and you can see it has the like flat edges this time instead of the rounded in edges and I feel like it's kind of going back to the original design where it had flat edges like I feel like my old like iPods looks like this but it's definitely interesting so definitely a different feel in terms of size they feel the same but it looks like the screen on this one takes up more space if you can kind of see I don't know if you can kind of tell but again the edges are different and this screen is bigger so let's see if we can turn it on it's so pretty I also ordered a um, Amazon case and it got delivered today so we'll see if it even fits but okay we're gonna turn it on there it goes this is so exciting honestly the silver does look white so keep that in mind if you're wanting like a dark gray or a silver silver it truly looks white which I love so we are going to start to turn it on English country okay so I'm gonna have to like set it up on the side but because in my last video i said how lot oh my gosh in my last video i said i had a lot of photos well now this photo has or this phone has like 80,000 photos on it 
and I know you guys are gonna put crazy shit in the comments. It's fine. I'm a content creator, so I'm like always taking pictures and I I always forget to go back through and delete the ones I don't use, so that's why I have so many pictures. So don't hate. You know, we don't need any hate here, only positive vibes, but I mean, I think the cameras look the same too, but obviously the quality in this one is a lot better. I feel like I'm talking like a million miles a minute, but yeah, it's just, it's so interesting. Kind of like trying to like compare, but I mean, in terms of holding, I feel like this one is actually a little bit easier to hold with the square edges as opposed to the round edges, but I mean, they're both massive. Actually holding them up to each other, the new one is bigger, so. Yeah, it is beautiful. It says 5G on it. So excited. So excited for a new color. Love switching it up. I love white. I'm a very aesthetic person, so aesthetic things make me happy. This one had a good run. I'm gonna ship her back to T-Mobile so that they can refurbish and resell or whatever they do with phones. And then I'm gonna start setting this guy up. But hopefully you guys liked this video. Honestly, there was not much in the box. I showed you the box. <laughs> it's even smaller than the last box. So, and again, it just comes with the cord and it's the USB-C. It's the smaller one, um, but yeah so excited and I'm gonna go set it up now you, it would probably be really boring to watch me set it up so just as like quick start you can bring your other iPhone to set it up it like shows like I don't even know the screen's not gonna pick it up okay you can just set up new iPhone quick start and then I hit continue and then you scan this with the other phone to set it up Okay, enter the passcode of your other phone. Okay, and it says setting up your iPhone. So honestly, it's probably gonna take a couple hours to upload everything from this phone to this phone, but that's okay. Yeah, it says it may take a few minutes to activate your iPhone. It says to keep this one near while the information is being transferred. So that's crazy, it's like all on the cloud. The cloud is gonna put what's on this, to what's on this and yeah i'm just so happy honestly i'm so happy for the camera i need to do some more experimenting using this okay so it says face id okay so now i'm going to set up my face id position frame okay. there we go move your head slowly in a circle to set up face id we're gonna do it again face id is set up now great moving right along. Transfer from your iPhone or the iCloud. Hmm. I'm gonna do this all off camera because it's probably not that interesting to you guys. Again, here is the comparison of them side by side. This one is bigger. Again, the edges, you can see this one is more flat. This one is round. These are what the screens look like. I'm gonna finish setting it up. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me unbox the phone. Um, I'm gonna go learn more about it and how to use it and all the crazy cool new features. And I hope you guys like this video like you liked the last video. So if you have the new phone, let me know what you think. Let me know what I need to check out. Um, yeah, let me know if you guys have any questions in the comments below and I'll try to answer as best as I can. But thank you so much for watching. My camera just died as I was finishing up there. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you next time. Bye.